In this video, I'm gonna show you how I create these clean screen flashes. A lot of editors, including my older self, would put effects onto the clips and after effects and actually use effects to create the flashes that way. I used to use the effect brightness and contrast where I would just up the brightness of the clip. Um, I would then even add glow and after effects. Um, but after I'd watch a lot of the bigger montages like Muggsy and CJ's Avengers montage, I'd actually go frame by frame in the video to see kind of how they did their screen flashes. So later I would use the effect exposure, kind of getting some closer to what I was looking for. But today I actually have a simpler effect, which I find looks better. Now it's gonna seem obvious, but it's a simple solution. I just add a white solid to my composition. I place it under my effect and then I play with the opacity of the clip. So you click your clip and press T to bring up opacity. Go one frame before you want the flash to start. Add a keyframe so that it's at 100% opacity. Then move one frame over to where you want it to begin flashing. And I put it at around 80% as a good starting location. But really you can play around with the opacity to find what you like. Sometimes I only do 95%, just have like a subtle flash and it looks good too. But then move a second or so later, could be just several keyframes, or sorry, several frames later, and bring it back up to 100%. So that's it, three keyframes, 100%, 80% or your desired uh, percentage obviously then back up to 100. Uh, that's it a clean screen flash and personally I like the way this style looks you could try like I said with brightness exposure things like that but this is just a almost like a cleaner flash I find and you could replace the white solid with a black solid if that's the desired effect you're going for but it's up to you. Thanks guys and have a good day.